Draw lines is because we're expecting some sort of disruption. What should we be on the lookout for? Hey, Sherry, that's exactly right. It's just such a big upgrade. We're going to need to be watching for you know, all sorts of little glitches that might take place, but you know, it could go smoothly as well. A lot of the exchanges and kind of other people around Ethereum are pausing things for a while just to make sure everything goes decently well. It's expected at about 1 p.m. Singapore time, 1 a.m. New York time at this point. So you know, we'll see in coming hours exactly what happens and then there will be say the potential forks off of it if you do ethereum proof of work you know there there could be other things coming up after the actual merge takes place as well and joanna i guess for want of a better way of phrasing this why is this such a big deal what is substantively going to change other than the i guess the appeal from an esg perspective yeah, well, the ESG perspective is definitely one of the big things, and it does just change the narrative on crypto, right, that people have been concerned about the energy consumption, and this helps with that with Ethereum. And, you know, we'll see what else happens with it. There sometimes in the past with things like this have been bugs and scams that come out. People will have to watch for that. But it does help with that, and it kind of changes the power structure of Ethereum. So it'll be interesting to see how that work shakes out as well, where you have different groups that have been doing mining and might need to move into other things to, uh, you know, to make things continue to work.